Hey guys, welcome back. It's Finit Designs here with a brand new tutorial. We are going to be starting a new series on my channel and it's going to be on Affinity Publisher and it's currently in beta. It just went into beta today. Um, so we are going to be going through some uh, basic document setup in this video and make sure to subscribe and hit the notification so that you don't miss out on future videos on Affinity Publisher. So let's get started by opening up Affinity Publisher beta. When you open up Affinity Publisher, we will be brought to this document screen. Now it says uh, to create a new document and you have a few tutorials that you can follow with samples and uh, some latest news. So let's just click new document. Now we're given some options to choose before we actually create the document um, to help us uh, create the settings and uh, format. Uh, the type print if you're going to be creating document for print then choose print uh, for web you can choose web and so on and also there's uh, the page presets and that's pretty much just a preset of the document size but we can customize it manually by going down here to change the page width and the height right now i have it to 11 by 17 but we can also uh, deselect the portrait to make a landscape and the DPI 300 if you are going to be designing for print and 72 for web. And uh, if you go back to the top, um, there is a check mark for facing pages. Now facing pages basically creates uh, a spread. So when you, for example, when you open up a book and uh, you have two pages, one on the left and one on the right. So that's basically what a spread is and or facing pages. If you just want a single page, then you can deselect that and you will have a single page. We will start with facing pages just to um, give you an idea of what that looks like and we can arrange that horizontally or vertically horizontally will basically just um, create a book format so a page on the left and a page on the right and then the start on is right and we'll see why that is on right right now and start on is on right right now the color is set to rgb but you can change it to whatever you like and uh, for print format we will be using cmyk once you have your dimensions set up and your other settings ready to go, including margins, uh, which you can edit at the bottom right here, you can click OK and we will be ready to go with the document. 